This is Notes Writer. And as you can see, I got the samples for Note Writer for my iPad. Different type samples. I'm going to go ahead and work on work today, which would have the clock and the calendar in the upper left hand corner. And as you can see, I got to the right job letter, the mail letter, resume, and notes. You click on any one of the three to the right for what you want to see what the text would look like. But I'm going to go ahead and click on the one on the left. And as you can see, this is for note taking. Let's see. At the top, I have today's date on it. I'm going to click on the scissors. And as you can see, there's a square box encircling the date. I can move it down and around and set it. And as you can see on top of it, it would say style, note, copy, or delete. As you can see over here, I can write the thickness of the pencil. And blend mode for whatever I want. Like normal, multiply, screen, overlay, darken. Then I can decrease it. As you can see, it's getting lighter or darker according to what I want it. Well, let's just keep it at 2.5. For now, and move it up in the middle. Now, we'll start off with uh, this pen here. Here will not only enable you to write, but it would also erase the lines, as you can see when you write the letters down on it now we'll go to erase uh, if you tap it twice you can pick the size you want for the eraser and the lines will come back double click again to make it smaller as you can see so you can erase large amounts at once or in small segments then the pencil to write what I just used. Here's the lines will be erased while you're writing. And over here, the lines will be intact when you're writing. Smith. Let's see. This. Okay. Seems to be misspelling my words today. <clears throat> Over here, we'll write Smith. Goes. Back line, and that will be erased. I can either use the eraser or the backspace with the arrow. Two. Town. You visit cousins and then over here if you go to the top where the different colors are you can pick a different color for the writing experience and when the Weekend is over. 
he goes home. Now, I had the blue and then the red. Let's go ahead and tap the green. As you can see. And spins. Let's see. We go to black. The night home. As you can see, if you get bored with one color, you can go ahead and change colors on it. Now we're going to go ahead and use the highlighter. Now, if you tap it twice, you can increase or decrease the size of it. The thickness, as you can see the over here, let's leave it at 14. As you can see, it's small. It's quite adequate. We click it twice again. Go all the way up to 40. And look. Or spins. It's much thicker. Decrease it to 20. It's slightly smaller, but still large. And then we click on the hand, and we can move the page where up and down. As you can see, with the pencil, the Apple Pencil, click twice, and as we do the highlighter and whatnot, we got the different colors, the, the background color, which you can change. Let's see, we had it on white. Let's go to blue. Oh, huh. background color I guess not all right and if I hit the, in the upper left hand corner you got like the three squares you click on that and it'll bring up the pages two pages side by side Over here, when I click on the page above, you get these here, ink line one, and so on. You can type in search, search for a document. If you press edit, you can delete one if you wish. You highlight and make sure the it's got the check mark. And you press on the garbage can. And when you're done, you click on that. Save. Then you click on this. And then the three dots in the upper right-hand corner, you click on that. And then it says, go to a page, read motor, mode, split view, paper, share. And if you want to print what you're writing, you go up here where it says print with notations at the bottom in blue you would print and then over here you would see at the bottom the page you had written in different colors and then on over here on top you would see the printer it's right now a searching for printer what you would seen before over here will be brother MFC and the model number. Then the number of copies below that, like if you want to increase it to one, two, three, by pressing plus or minus back to one. Then the options, double-sided, which has got the green, of course it's on. Then black and white, which is off. Then you got the gray, but if you want to switch it to on, 
you'll get all one color as you just seen. And you switch it back to off. It's different colors. I'm not going to print it, but you get what I mean. And then, uh, let's see. Try the yellow. Oops. Thank you. All right, I guess that would be it.